food-based dietary guidelines have a big impact on many different areas and discussing plant-based diets and plant-based substitutes to animal-based foods can be a key step in making dietary recommendations more sustainable and healthy as well as more inclusive. The current large-scale evaluations of dietary guidelines do not assess whether and to what extent different countries cover the broad spectrum of plant-based diets and with this I mean diets with some or no animal-based products, if they have policy positions on vegetarian and vegan diets and if they mention specific plant-based alternatives to milk, dairy products and meat. So with our research we provide an international overview that was really needed to identify possible action areas but also best practice examples that can form the basis for enhanced dietary guidelines and also for the discussion about dietary guidelines development. Uh, so we evaluated 95 national dietary guidelines covering 100 countries from all over the world. In a nutshell, there is ample room for improvement across the globe in coming years. But um, there were also some countries that implement some certain points very well. And I think these examples are exactly um, needed and can help policymakers. The recommendations in dietary guidelines urgently need to become more balanced. They also need to become more inclusive by considering ethical, ecological, religious and economic aspects that play a role in people's food choices.